In this tutorial, we will go over how to analyze a package in the Package Smart Demo project. Now that we have our current design and an alternative built, let's analyze to compare the differences. Click on the Analyze tab on the left of your screen to the right of the Build tab. In this screen, all of our package inventory will be listed on the left in the categories we assign to them. Highlight the packages that we want to analyze and drag them into the package detail window on the right. Select the Super Spray Cleaner current design and the Recycled Super Spray Cleaner. Let's take a closer look at the package details window. First notice on the top, there is a field to enter the functional unit, the consumer meaningful unit of measure. The functional unit will be displayed on all of the analysis graphs. A functional unit is important when you are comparing two packages that contain different amounts of a product. You want to make sure that you are comparing two packages that provide the same function. For more information on functional units, click on the quick link called Why is a functional unit important to display the help file definition of a functional unit. Type in the functional unit of 32 ounces super spray cleaner. Since both of our packages contain 32 ounces of cleaner, we will type 1 in the quantity field. If one of the packages contained more or less than 32 ounces of cleaner, we would adjust the quantities to reflect a fair comparison. Over on the right is a drop down selection called Packaging Level. Select a level that you want to analyze. This can be the complete package with all of the levels or an individual level such as primary, secondary, tertiary, or distribution transport. Let's select primary, as this is the level where our two packages differ. Now click Analyze. Your analysis results will be displayed in the lower part of the analysis screen. Scroll down to see the results. Results will be displayed in the lower part of the analysis window. Results can be displayed at the impact level, also known as damage within the impact assessment method nomenclature, and at the normalization level. Please see our help file for a description of normalization. Within these levels, there are three types of displays available, bar charts, radar charts, and data tables. Let's click on the data table. Here you can see the units of measure for each indicator and the amount of impact for each of the primary packages. For a description of the indicators and how they are calculated, please go to the web page address listed here. Clicking on the bar chart tab, we can compare the two bottles relative to each other. The bottle with the highest impacts receives 100% and the other bottle is displayed as a percentage of the highest impacting bottle. So in the case of climate change, ecosystems and human health, the recycled HDPE bottle has between 10 to 20% fewer impacts than the virgin bottle. And in the cumulative energy demand and resources categories, the recycled bottle has about 60% fewer impacts than the virgin bottle. It is possible to just look at one indicator in your bar chart and to view the radar charts as well. If we just wanted to analyze the full impacts of our current design, you can scroll up to the package detail window, delete the recycled super spray bottle, and change our packaging level to packaging system. Then click Analyze. Scroll down to see the results. Here we are seeing the impacts by packaging level, primary, secondary, and tertiary, as well as transport. We can look at the data table, bar chart, and radar chart, as we did in our comparison. We also have the results in another format, life cycle phase. Here we see the impacts broken down by life cycle phase, as the name suggests, which includes material, conversion, distribution, and end of life. You can save the graphs in JPEG format by clicking Save Graph in the bottom right part of your screen. You can also save the data tables as Excel spreadsheets.
This concludes the PackageSmart demo project analyzing the package tutorial. The next tutorial in this series is PackageSmart demo project how to use reports. If you have any questions, email support at or dial 802 434 3326 extension 2.